Alright guys, welcome back to another video and today we got some very good news for you guys who are using the older Galaxy Buds, not the Galaxy Buds Plus, but the first generation Samsung decided to push an update yesterday so I just got it. So it's not just an ordinary update, it's a pretty good update. So let me just zoom in for you guys. So you can see it says I have an update available on my earbuds. So you can see the change lock over here. So you can see the size is about 1.39 MB and we got a new version of uh, ATO D2. So if what it says here is pretty nice actually. They say sound quality optimization, optimization code has been improved. Apply it and we have the ambient sound now works with a uh, touch sensitive tester. It works with when only wearing one earbud which is nice. So, so which means when you take your earbuds, usually you have to plug into your ears to get the uh, ambient sound to work but after the update you should be able to just use uh, one that's nice and reading on we have also swift pair so it says it's supported in connecting to a windows uh, windows pc that has version 19, uh, 18.03 and above swift pair i'm assuming is like uh, it's just a faster way of pairing instead of going to the bluetooth menu and we have also a music app list has been added a preset tempo feature so i think this will be they were at Spotify, uh, FLO, Genie and Melon currently which is nice so I'm using Spotify which means I can uh, take use of, make use of that feature and lastly uh, I think that's it so this is a caution don't use while it's updating here yeah. so I'm going to go ahead and install the update and try it out for myself so let us install it so it's very small but I think it'll take a while to transfer the files you can see it's uh just 1.39 max but it will still take a while for it to transfer the file so now it's a copying software update you can see it's copying the updates over to my galaxy but so let's uh, uh let's go through the updates once the process is done and i'll be right back all right guys so we have done installing the update so you can go to uh, about the uh, buds earbuds and you can go to check the updates you can see my software version is now AD, uh, ATD2 which is the latest one I showed you earlier so finally I've updated so based on the user interface of the uh, Galaxy Rebels app doesn't seem there doesn't seem to be much changes in the overall UI overall it's the same we still have the same battery percentage we don't have a battery percentage for the case sadly I don't think this is supported with the first generation uh, so yeah the main changes are actually in the touchpad area you can see now we have this uh, lock touchpad. I don't remember we have this feature in the previous version, so we can lock it now. And what if we click on left, you see we have a new uh, Spotify option. So if I click uh, Spotify on, uh, if I long press Spotify on my left earbud, it will open Spotify, which is fantastic. So I'm gonna put it back to the quick ambient sound. And uh, we have the ambient sound. This is also the nice feature. So let's say you want to use just uh, one earbud just take it out you can see it's still on and i put it on my ear and you can see i can still uh, wear this despite having the uh, ambient sound on it still stays on not like last time where you have to put in both to get it to work so finally samsung has done the update and has uh, fixed it i mean they enhanced it i mean so which is fantastic and obviously we have a uh, thing that's all the major changes this one has, doesn't have changed notification has still no change so yeah pretty nice exciting new features that we got with the galaxy buds first generation i thought they wouldn't even send any updates anymore because the galaxy buds uh, plus the newer generation it's uh, i think they, that one is more a better device but considering samsung still pushes update to their older devices which means they still uh, how to say they still uh, care about customers who still having the old ones which is nice so we can enjoy the latest features that the Galaxy Buds Plus have on our old ones. So guys, that's all for this video. Thank you much for watching. Stay tuned for more videos like this one. As always, stay home, stay safe. Peace out.